Hello, my name is Chris from Lifter LMS, and in this video, I want to give you a quick tour of all the amazing theme options that are in our newly released WordPress LMS theme called Launchpad, which is designed to work perfectly with Lifter LMS. And you can also build a great looking website, even if you're not building the online courses portion and using Lifter LMS with Launchpad. So I want to show you that Launchpad here is installed on a WordPress site. We've got it activated and you can find all the Launchpad theme options over here under Appearance Launchpad. And then I'm just gonna kind of walk you through all these amazing settings and all this control you get over your website without needing to know how to code or be a programmer. So over here in the header section, you can see where we can add a logo, uh, we can display a tagline message, and uh, we can display a title font and start changing the color of those things and start adjusting what our, our menu looks like and, and how that operates. Then over here in the advanced area you can see we have a drop zone where if you're using some third-party software and you need to drop in some JavaScript you can do that without having to call a developer or, or hire somebody and just simply drop it in this drop zone here. So here in the footer you can see where we you can change the background color and start uh, changing the padding and the spacing and that sort of thing. Down here in the site info, this is really a common area at the very, very bottom of any website, not just an online courses website. There's often some copyright text uh, and maybe something else on the right side, some more links or resources and that sort of thing. So we've given you control over the foot of your site so that you can easily change that without having to modify any kind of templates or anything like that. Over here in the layout settings, you can set the width of your site. You can set a background image to go with the header. Uh, you can change the default layout and you can change this on a per page basis but you can decide that okay in general I want my site to have a right sidebar or left sidebar two sidebars or no sidebar so that's what that layout option is in terms of typography we bring in the complete Google font library so that you can experiment with all these amazing fonts and and really um, you know bring in your style of a and, and brand to a font that works well for you and of course you can adjust those sizes based on where that font is displaying and over here you can see where we've given you control over the breadcrumbs so the breadcrumbs are like links at the top of the site under the menu which kind of show you where you are so that you can if you've kind of nested down deeper into the site it's really common on more complex sites so we've given you control over the breadcrumbs if you want to include those as another form of navigation on your site. We've also given you just some general styling control so that you don't have to write these types of things with CSS code. So you can modify what your links look like. You know, we often recommend the concept of having an action color. So once you pick that, that link color, that button color, you should really have like one primary uh, link color if you want somebody to click on something or do something uh, just try to be consistent with that uh, We've also given you control over all the buttons and Then you can see also all those heading fonts you can change the color of those and really develop your brand and style uh, Now you can see down here. We've got four more lifter LMS areas now these places show up on the launchpad theme the theme options when you have lifter LMS installed so that you can now start modifying various parts of the Lifter LMS portion of your site. So this Lifter LMS account is the user dashboard or the My Courses page. So we've given you control over that, the message that displays at the top, how that uh, alignment has worked. You can absolutely change the layout and the colors of so many things. You can put rounded corners on there. That's what this border radius is. And you can change, you know, if you don't want to call them achievements and you want to call them badges or trophies or whatever, you can change those titles. We've just given you a lot of control here in the My Courses dashboard to really create that student dashboard and student experience that you have in your mind. So there's a lot of options here. You just need to dig in and, and start playing with these and develop uh, that that image or that you have in your mind of what you want that student experience to look like on their dashboard. Now if we go back up here, we can head on over to the Lift LMS course. You can change the title size of the course, the font color, uh, the, you can change various things around the, pri the pricing and all the, all the course elements are, are given to you to control with the color and the sizing and the padding and all these things. 
to give you complete control over that course page to make it look uh, exactly like you want it to. So I'm just showing you all the options here. Feel free to pause this video and you know go through it a little slower and check out all the options you get with Lifter LMS Launchpad theme. All right. So yeah, you can see down here where you can start modifying the design of the progress bar and really just create create it in the brand and in the style that, that you have in your mind. So the product archive page for Lifter LMS, so if you're not familiar with the term archive, that just kind of means like the all courses page. So those are the course tiles and you can really start modifying those and what those look like. You could put rounded corners on them. You could give uh, them a background color. You could make the, that color change if somebody hovers over a particular course. And you could, um, you know, really just start modifying what that course catalog looks like and, and how it lays out on the page. So just check out all these options and, and have fun experimenting with those. And then the last one here is the Lifter LMS product checkout. We've given you control over that so that you can change the width of the checkout screen. You can make it wide or narrow. You can mess with the border color or the, the various uh, backgrounds that come with within the checkout forms and the checkout screen. So, uh, <clears throat> and you can also, you know, change the titles for, you know, some of the elements that come up on that page. So that's a quick tour of the Lifter LMS Launchpad theme. If you'd like to have more uh, information about it and check out our demo, head on over to lifterlms.com launchpad.